What's going on, everybody? Z here. Welcome back to some more Terra Tech. I know we're back. We're doing the things. We're going to build the super amazing vehicular contraption today. Hopefully, you guys enjoy the video. If you do, maybe consider subscribing. If you haven't already, don't forget to leave a like on the video as well. That was kind of backwards. I'm sorry. Anyways, the first thing that I want to do, you bet you, is I want to get a little teeny tiny little flyer. I want a little teeny tiny flyer so we can go around, we can explore, we can do some things and how I'm going to do that. Now, I've actually had some, uh, I've had some questions about how you get another tech in while you have a tech. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take a screenshot and this will allow me to, you know, have the tech. So we'll name this tech to uh, 2020. Yeah, mm, save. Cool. All right. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead I'm gonna grab myself a, uh, a building block and I'm just gonna grab a cab and we're just gonna place it on the ground like that. That's all you have to do. And then you right click on it or whatever button you may be playing with and just go to switch tech. That's it, that's all you have to do. Super easy peasy. Now, what I am going to do to prevent any, uh, like any kind of like, cr I don't wanna say cross contamination, <laughs> but that's like the first word that comes to my mind is I'm actually gonna build this tech while this tech is still out. That way I'm not using any parts that are required to build this guy. So I can build, you know, multiple different techs. Now, what I mean by that is if I used, say, like too many of something on here and this tech had those blocks and this tech required certain blocks to like bring back in, then I wouldn't be able to build it. But we shouldn't have that issue. So let's go ahead and let's get on into it, shall we? I guess we're going to use a venture standard block because it's the only one we have. <laughs> and we'll throw a little teeny tiny nose cone on there. And then we're going to need, we're going to need some like a regular kind of blocky bit that will probably be big enough and then we're gonna need some wheels as well so we'll throw that there that there we'll do some wingage stuff on here i don't know these might this might be too much for this guy i don't recall it's been a while i'm sorry i'm sorry it's been a while we're gonna make like a little uh a little dual prop guy like that oh is he so cute it is so cute okay so this is a left hand airfoil so we're going to throw that on there we got a right hand airfoil we'll throw that on there where's the rudder rudder oh <gasps> you know what i don't have elevators i don't have the rear ones mm, you know we might not be doing this this might not work for us <gasps> i don't know we'll go ahead we'll, we'll play with it we'll try we'll try we'll we'll give it they try and then i think i'm just gonna use some little teeny tiny kind of block deals we'll go ahead and throw one maybe right there like that let me get a tail dragger and maybe we'll go with like these ones on the front one there and one there okay so literally that's all i'm gonna build hey 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 get, stop that you stop that um i'm gonna build uh it's not gonna work i don't have the elevators you know what i don't need these blocks either okay let's see there we go yeah, it's kind of, I have zero control. I have absolutely no control over this thing whatsoever. Oh, jeez! Get back to the other tech! Quick! No! Come on! You can do it, man. Oh, jeez. Okay. Back. We gotta get back here. I don't have elevators, so I don't have any, um, any control over it, essentially because all I have are these, which should give us the uh, the side to side, but I need like up and down. I don't have up and down control because these aren't these aren't the elevators. So uh, let's let's just yeah. <laughs> let's get back at this guy. <gasps> that was an absolute. F you have no flight controls on your current control scheme. Oh, wait, hold on a second. Is that what the issue is? Like if I switch this to uh, aeroplane, fly an exit. I don't think we have controls. Maybe? No, we do not. We do not. We don't have the controls that we need. Quickly, get, get back. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you know what? We're just gonna switch to this guy and we're gonna, we're gonna package this stuff up. So I need some more, uh, I need some more elevator stuffs. So that's fine. That's fine because we're, uh, we're in an area we can do some things. Let's go ahead. Let's start that. So do we have any missions? I need some missions for some things. Catch me if you can, accept that one, accept, accept. Okay, cool, I'll accept it. So I want to, I want to focus on these ones for now because those are the venture ones and it looks like it's over this way. Okay, so we're gonna make our way over here. We're gonna blow up some things. These tiny, these techs are tiny. Like, why are they so small? I don't, I don't, I don't get it. 
also i think we might ditch the fireworks just because it's like impossible to see the actual like <laughs> the actual fight you know all right so we got to get this guy and he's he's kind of down here in a in this horrible cavern and this is not a rover made for traverse traversing stuff uh de destroy the champion you're the champion you don't look like much of a champion dude i'm sorry but like it is what it is you know let's see do we get any flight blocks i need more flight no i need more we got another firework launcher <laughs> that's kind of cool all right where is my this guy oh i thought it was gone i thought i might have left it somewhere okay so we'll grab that and it oh my gosh this is a terrible area oh what is this a power lift hover pad Ooh, there's some more blocks in here that i haven't seen before either i think it's because they're experimental but uh yeah that's kind of neat what is this area what why is this all blue i've never seen a blue area before what is going on here all right we got rid of that nuisance what is this is there an ice area when did they add this i have never seen one of these before you know what we're gonna go up it we're gonna go up uh i think we might do a little bit of redesign here this rover does not turn very well and i, I think we could throw some better wheels on here <laughs> unfortunately like it doesn't oh my gosh it doesn't want to go up there i really want to check out that area i've never seen like a frozen tundra looking area before all right so that seems to be a little bit better it actually kind of turns around yeah that turns around much better now is it actually it's pretty quick it's not it's not too terribly slow all right i like those wheels a little bit better you know what though they're not the right color that's not good there we go okay everything they look so dinky oh my gosh they look so terrible <laughs> i don't think i have any other wheels that would be like even remotely close we don't have any like tank tracks or anything like that oh that'll be in the future okay so let's continue on we gotta find crafty mike again all right let's find crafty mike where are you crafty mike what is this thing uh it's dead is what it is <laughs> lol drill <laughs> i love the name it is so cute a friendly tech is sending out a distress signal oh no we must protect all right let the protections begin is this guy small enough we could just drive over the top of him no it's not darn it i was hoping it would be all right let's go ahead and defend this guy real quick it'll be super easy and super boring all right waves cleared what did we get anything good hopefully maybe probably not nah, i mean not terrible Ooh, we got a big boy coming in here huh we'll see how much of a big boy it actually is so i think we really need to get a plane and we need to fly away because i think we actually managed to like kind of go back towards the starting area and i don't know but i think the closer you are to the starting area the smaller the techs as well as like like this there's no way this guy's gonna be a challenge i say that and we're gonna get absolutely wrecked let's just start shooting i'm waiting for you come on man drop it oh holy shamoles nope that guy was actually hey wow we took that guy out quick <laughs> grade four that's what's up did we get anything good uh it had a giant cannon on it well we got a couple batteries i guess that's not the worst thing ever all right let's drop those down in here uh we got a big wheel a whole bunch of venture stuff i mean that, you know it's not that great we need to we need to move on we need to find a better area oh we did get the big gun oh the megaton cannon you know what i think we need to outfit it we will indeed let's do that right now one megaton cannon coming on up bada bing <gasps> bada boom oh yes big cannon the big boy cannon all right let's get this put away all right what you got for me this time crafty mike you gotta make this snappy i'm on a mission to explore and do more with my life in need of some resources i'm not about to deliver you some re oh man i am about to deliver you some resources just dump them in that silo once you've found them oh come on you know what i don't even want to do it right now we're gonna do something more fun i don't want to go collect stuff <laughs> that doesn't sound exciting at all oh that guy is like full of flight blocks wow and they're all gone yep not a single one sir oh there's still a tech in there let's get rid of that guy there now he's gone Darn, not a single one of those fans survived. Ooh, this one's worth 2,000 XP. Defend tech for duration attack. Birds of... Oh, investigate the area. Investigate the unidentified heat signature. Yes. Oh, that's going to give us our, our our Hawkeye license. Oh. Oh. Ho, ho. Where are you? Birds of prey. License. Hawkeye. Oh, my gosh. It's happening, people. Oh, bigger techs are spawning in. Oh, this is wonderful. All right, we gotta go take this guy out. He's got some big blocks on him. Some big blocks. This is the big block boy. I don't know where your uh, where your stuff is at, but oh, and he's gone. Fantastic. All right, we gotta go do the birds of prey for sure. That has got to happen. 
What? There's a future tech? There's a future tech here. Have I seen him? No, but yeah. But like the fact that we've already, we're seeing a future tech right now. I'm super excited about that. We're going to go fight that guy and get some future tech blocks. <gasps> Ooh, I wasn't expecting to see any future techs. Oh, I mean, have we even seen an actual Hawkeye tech yet? I don't think we have. I mean, we got these two, these two weapons from a, uh, from like a base, but like a future tech deal. Oh, we gotta go check it out. Oh, you know what? Hold on a second. Is that, oh, we're going to get our future tech license as well. Oh my gosh. I'm super excited. Okay. Hold on. Let's do birds of prey first. I want to check that out. Uh, we gotta go over here and do this stuff. Oh, I'm super excited about this. We're going to get both licenses in one episode. That's amazing. We've detected an unidentified, unidentified heat signature up there in the sky. What's that? A bird, a plane. It's right there and it's down. <laughs> I mean, that's not a huge selling point for, uh, that's not, well, it crash landed, but it looks like mostly intact. See if you can get a closer look <gasps> and everything's gone. Wonderful. Uh Oh, uh oh back up back up okay these boys might actually give us a, a, a run for a month i don't think they will and that was easy enough pop <laughs> hawkeye license absolutely thank you so much for your goodies i'm so excited about that we got hawkeye people we got hawkeye stuff we gotta go talk to the future tech thing though too that's gonna be exciting that plane was like super cool looking really i'm really sad that it's uh that it just blew up like that. i wonder if there's any way to like grab it before it blew up probably not all right everything is pretty much collected looks good let's go ahead let's go right over here look at that there was the hawkeye license was right there the better future license is right there my gosh my gosh it's amazing i know it's super exciting all right so let's get over here let's get this guy let's talk to this i think we have to do some like uh maneuvering kind of stuff i think it's like a similar flight thing as the the venture stuff i think like you have to kind of like fly around with it if i'm not mistaken all right better future starting pre-recorded message look at how epic this stuff looks it just looks so cool greetings prospector you ever feel like you're lagging behind the times absolutely like you're rooted to the ground with no way of lifting yourself up you you know me too well perhaps what you need is a brighter future a better future i see what you did there our scientists here at Better Future Corporations are committed to developing cutting edge technology to help you attain electrological maneuver. I don't know what it said. I do want to achieve enlightenment. Ha, of course you do. Classic robot stuff. Right click the screen to embark on this journey now. I think you have to have a whole bunch of money. <gasps> 10,000 block bucks. Whatever will I do? Absolutely. Let's do it. Congratulations. Your path to enlightenment is clear and ready for liftoff. Thank you. Estimated delivery for your better future license is approximately four to six seconds. Contact. <laughs> Contact. No refunds. Do not reply for any. Fr <laughs> oh, thank you. And have a nice day. And it's gone. Better future. Yeah. That's amazing. Wait. Wait. So what? What? It, that, did I seriously just pay for? Uh, hey, hey. And it's gone. I think I just, I literally just bought the license. Like that was, that was all I did. I thought there was a thing. You had to like maneuver around and do stuff. All right. So the trading stations are restocked. Let's see if we can get any more uh, of those good missions. You know what I'm saying? We want some Hawkeye. We want some better future. I want that stuff. Well, you know, I really wanted some flight today, but I don't know if it's going to happen. All right. What do we got? Blitz attack, defense attack. Okay, cool. And a hover racetrack. Absolutely. Okay. Where's the hover racetrack? That's what, that's what we're going after. Of a racetrack, fantastic. We are going this way. Oh, it's right there. Hello, Hubble. I see what your name is. Right click the terminal to purchase a suitable racing vehicle. <gasps> I think I will. Can't afford 65,000. What? Darn it. We can afford it. Don't worry. Let's go ahead and let's set up a uh, low tech. Can I set up that one? Where's that one? That was like a pre made, pre fabricated. This one right here. Why can't I do? What am I missing? What am I missing? Missing blocks. What blocks am I missing? Tell me. Tell me what blocks I'm missing. I'm missing nine batteries. Is that it? I'm missing nine regular batteries. We'll just make our own. We'll make our own. Okay. So we need to make some money. Let's go ahead. Let's do some money making, I guess. We'll go ahead and set up. Wait, can I load up my other tech? No. No, I cannot. Because it's, uh, wait, 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 why? Cannot swap, cannot deploy. 
created cost 285,000. All right, I guess we're building a we're building a new factory, people. Let's give it. Wait, there's a trade station there, and a trade station right there. That's those are really really close. All right, let's do some quick base building here. Actually, you know what? I want an anchor block. Do I have an anchor block? I should have an anchor block. Where are my anchor blocks? Boom, anchor block. Thank you. Put you right there. Wonderful. And then we'll get some regular blocks. Why is this standard block? So <laughs> let's just go with that. So teeny tiny little base made fantastic. Now, do we have a scrapper fabricator refinery delivery can scrapper? That's what I need. That is 100% what I need here. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to do uh, some scrappy stuff. And then where's the output on this guy? Oh, it's like right there, huh? Interesting. Okay. So let's put this guy like over here right and then the scrap okay cool so that will oh actually it needs to be like one block up all right so scrapper right there fantastic we need some manufacturing stuff uh we're gonna need some conveyor belts to go like these over here and then we're gonna do uh we're just gonna do some selling that's all we're gonna do <laughs> that's literally all we're gonna do uh refiner i don't think we're gonna need to refine anything I'm pretty sure everything's good like it is. And we'll throw that in there. Like I so. We'll go ahead and turn these guys around. Like that. And then we're going to go through our weapon blocks. And look at all this big, huge stuff that I have absolutely no use for. Geocorp server's head light bore. Yeah, nope. Probably never going to use that. Let's just go ahead and scrap that guy. And look at this. It's going to turn into a whole bunch of useful little parts. Now, later on, I'm going to need these parts. But you know what? For now, we're just going to sell them for a whole lot of money. Let's see what we're going to get out of this guy. 111. 111. Wait for the last ones. The last ones are going to be the money ones. 252. 252. 575. And 650. Look at that. I think if we just sell two more of these things. Or maybe three. Maybe. We'll probably be good. Yeah, I don't think we're going to have any issue getting uh, the 65,000 that we're going to need. You know, the only thing that kind of sucks about this, though, is that we're literally, <laughs> we're literally about to use all of our money just for this. Like, all of our money. Oh, hey. Novice Harvester 3 mission complete. Oh, I probably had to sell so many items. Neato. That's kind of cool. What was that? Repair. Oh, <gasps> what was that? Is that a? Whoa, no, 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 no. You stop that. Bad. Bad scrapper. It's trying to steal all my stuff. All right, so note to self. Do, do not have a scrapper within any kind of vicinity of your air. Oh, is that a... What is that? Magnet? Radar? Medium ball. It's just a medium ball. <laughs> what the heck is that for? I have no idea. All right, so let's send that back. Let's go ahead and let's send this guy back. Don't need it anymore. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go buy ourselves our first little future tech tech oh i'm super excited to check this guy out i know what it is i think i don't know it's been a long time since i played with it yes please thank you i will take that tech and we only have three thousand monies now <laughs> i thought we were doing good too <gasps> look at the little t oh, it's so cute okay we're gonna fly you okay move up and down with the up and down arrow keys move forward and back with w and s okay so this becomes it's it's kind of weird i'm not gonna lie it's kind of weird because you can't adjust the camera angle you have to like constantly be playing with this. With you have to basically have both hands on the keyboards uh, to to do the stuff. And we've done it! My gosh, we've done it! All right, we're gonna get some future tech stuff. <gasps> but now we have a little. Oh my gosh! Now we're about to die. <laughs> oh no! Let's not die. Uh, okay, hold on. What is this thing? This thing's cool looking. Uh, linear motion engine. Oh, I can't wait to play with all this stuff. Oh, it's super cool. It's super cool. All right, let's go ahead and put those in there. And let's get back to our tech before we die. Now, we're going to take a screenshot of this guy. That way we can, like, continually... Oh, shoot. Get him. Get him. Get him. Yeah, we got him. Woo! All right. <laughs> now we're going to take a picture of this guy. So we can just bring it back in whenever we need to. Because if I don't use any better future stuff, then we should have everything. Hoverboard Mark V, save. Fantastic. All right, let's go back to this guy for now. Put you safely in our inventories and we'll take this stuff. Wonderful, wonderful. Do you have any missions for me? I hope you do. Oh, we have all, we have all the good ones. All right, what should we start with here? 
Uh, Black Op Dark Totem. Okay. Report to Sergeant Smash. <gasps> Ooh, find the delivery crate and hover trail. Okay. How far away are these? Uh, let's do this one real quick. We'll track that one and we'll do that one first. Oh, he's right there. It's right there. Super easy. Wait. Is that? Oh, it's probably the training dummy associated with this guy. All right. Apparently I was wrong. I guess what the heck is going on with this thing? The turret V3. <laughs> so the only problem with the mortars, like I have all these mortars on here, is that they rain fire down upon, you know, enemies, but it also destroys like all the blocks in the area that they're in. So it's kind of like not the greatest thing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What? I, uh, I didn't do anything. I just, I literally rolled up next to it. It did, I, did, I didn't do anything. <gasps> Look at the tracks, we got some tracks. I didn't do anything. Just report to him, I guess. Like he didn't, he didn't even talk. Like nothing, nothing was said. That was weird. Normally like it, it said something, you have to interact. I guess not. Ooh, this guy's full of venture blocks. I could use those for my flights, for my flight machines. Too bad I'm gonna destroy like all of them. Maybe? Oh, okay, we got a few. I mean, we got a couple. So it looks as though we're gonna have to do this race deal. So I'm gonna go ahead and anchor my block. We're gonna load a tech. We're gonna load this guy in. Deploy new tech right there. Fantastic. And let's go ahead and swap to this. All right, so we're gonna do this little, this this thing right here. It's gonna be a good time. Let's go ahead, let's hover around. Whee! Oh geez. Whoa. Okay, we're fine. We're good. We got this. This is, I love these things. These things are so cool. You know, I gotta say, I feel like they, uh, improved the controls of this because i i think the first time i played with it it was it was kind of rough it was a little hard to play with but maybe that was because it was the first time i played with it and not like this time i played with it <laughs> all right up here perfect down here we've done it my gosh all right let's go switch back to this guy i don't like i don't like flying around with this guy because it's, it's like it's super squishy uh oh i'm anchored okay open up this guy what do we got anything good <gasps> oh give me the goods what do we got Ooh, ooh. we got like a tail fin what is this uh a claw plasma cutter oh that's cool and then a small rotor very fun so that mission's done let's go over here let's get this crate i still want to explore that like icy area i've never seen that before i cannot remember a single time that i've seen that like icy blue area now is this a free crate or do i have to destroy a whole bunch of stuff Free crate, destroy stuff. Free crate, nope, destroy stuff. Alrighty, I like it. You know what, let's go ahead and anchor. And let's just go to town. Yep, goodbye. And goodbye. Perfect. Too easy. Much too easy. Can I have the crate now? <gasps> Thank you. We got some wheels, we got a couple wheels. What did it give us? It doesn't give us like anything good. Wait, what is this thing? Pack collector? I don't want that. <laughs> what am I gonna do with that? Small landing skid? That's kind of cool. We can make like a little, oh, I wonder if we can make like a little teeny tiny helicopter. Oh, it's this guy. That's a that's a piece of something. And it's it's black, so it must be a, a Hawkeye piece. We better take it. You never know, we might need that. That piece right there could mean everything. Okay, I think that's actually, <laughs> that was all the missions that we had for that. Darn it, I want more missions. <laughs> Let's go check this guy again, maybe. You got any more missions for me? Ooh, Black Ops Cleaning House. Find Sergeant Smash, you're private. Check with Sergeant Smash for orders. Awesome, let's do it. Where, wait. Oh, what's up, Sergeant Smash? Welcome back. I was worried that you left me forever. Just keep me waiting. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you the tough job. Oh, are you now? You think you are, huh? I don't think he's gonna give us a tough job. I think it's gonna be super easy. Go knock down the numbers. I said go. Okay, so what do we, what do we do? What are we doing here? Uh, We're going to hunt enemy techs. 10 of them, that's it? I can't take long at all. Hmm. Is there a mission that says defend? Where's the defend mission that we had? Because that would knock out both of them. Wave of bullies. Let's do that one. All right, so I did the responsible thing. I know, believe it or not, I charged up before I went in. Because <laughs> my battery was actually super... Wait, is that the tech that we're defending? No. No, that's the tech we're defending. Oh my goodness. All right, we really got to get rid of... <laughs> We've got to get rid of those uh, those firework launchers. They're kind of obnoxious. That's only two. Are you serious? Is that it? Oh no, there's three more. Okay, perfect. 
I was worried that we weren't. <gasps> these things are all like really good. Let's throw these over here. All right, there's three more. Dunskis. Let's grab this guy. All right, that was too easy. I'm trying not to destroy all these blocks. Those guys are worth, I mean, those guys are worth money. You've seen that. What in the heck? It started off with like three like large techs and then it's just like, never mind. <laughs> We're not gonna give you any more large guys. All right, looks like that's all. Well, okay, one more. There's always one more. It says like, oh, that's it. You showed him. And then it, it brings in another one. All right, let's get rid of... Oh, wait. Whoa, whoa, hold on a second. Oh, no, that was the Hawkeye one. No, don't you destroy all my stuff. Oh, okay. Ooh, what is that? What is this? Repulsor cannon? What? Hold on, we got to collect everything. We have got to try that out. That looks like an like a like oh my that looks amazing what is that i'm so excited all right what is this repulsor cannon thing this thing looks amazing <laughs> where is it weapon block where is it? it's a big boy it is a big one a a anti-air oh it's an anti-aircraft repulsor cannon so does this repulsor cannon is a ground to air anti-aircraft weapon that fires an electromagnetic charge which generates a repulsion pulse when they collide with a the target these pulses cause low damage to the target but have very high impulse force which knock most flying techs off course making it very difficult to continue flying once hit this weapon can only be placed in an upright orientation what and then we had a oh hold on hold on no 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 that thing looks dope though i like it uh, but then we also have a vibro a high frequency blade that uses fine vibrations to reduce drag when cutting through things. That's kind of cool looking. I like it. All right. So let's collect that guy back up. I and I like I knew it looked like an anti-aircraft thing, but I was thinking maybe it'd, like pop up and like shoot outwards and be like, you know, like alternating cannons. That'd be super cool. But I don't think that's what it does. You know what? We should I feel like we should throw it on here. Let's you know what? Let's collect it up. Let's get back to our base and make sure we're nice and safe first. All right, so we are back. Do we have any more missions? Oh my gosh, we have more. Seek out Sergeant Smash, assassinate the turret. Report to Sergeant Smash behind enemy lines. He has a job for you, recruit. Don't keep him waiting. And a delivery crate up for... Look at how like minimal the XP is. Well, we are super early in our... Uh... Oh, it's only a 500. Wow. We'll grab both of those uh, before the things like refresh. And you know, I'm actually kind of curious. I was thinking about that anti-aircraft repulsor cannon. I don't think I've ever seen like a enemy tech in the game that's flying. Like I've seen like hovercraft, but I don't think I've actually ever seen one flying. Like the uh, the birds of prey thing, I've never seen one in the sky that's actually flying around that would actually come in around and like, you know, attack you. So I'm curious to check that out. It is experimental. It's like an experimental block. So maybe that's what it's for. I don't know. I don't know. It's super cool. I'm excited, but that's going to end our episode, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. Subscribing does really help out the channel a lot, and I do appreciate it. Also, special thanks to all the Patreons out there. Thank you guys for that additional support. It really helps, you know, me do what I do. So uh, thank you guys so much for that. And I will catch you in the next episode. Fireworks! 